Hi guys, my name is Crystal and welcome to my YouTube channel and Christmas Day was on a Saturday, Boxing Day is a Sunday. What more can you ask for? Lovely loud church bells ringing through my window this lovely Boxing Day morning. I love church bells. And the bell ringers are pulling and it's so Christmassy and festive. All we're missing is snow. It's raining outside, unfortunately. Alexa, what's the time, please? The time is 9.58 a.m. Um, I'm fine. Um, my mum has been ill for a very long time and she's... Obviously, mental health illness is, is a, a nasty thing and she's been coping for years now without workers. Um, my mum, I feel, has never really got on with me. Um, my sister was the favourite. I've been up in Gloucestershire for 22 years and I hadn't seen my mum and my parents hadn't bothered to come and see me in 22 years. I had a little boy that was dying of liver disease and not one of them came up to see my, my, my children. She, she can't, she's never accepted my children as her grandchildren. Um, my sister's daughter has a child and my mum will give her presents, will talk to her, but she's never got on with my, me or my children. I feel that my mother is, puts up with me and she's never really liked me. Um, I'm not attractive. In fact, I felt as a child I was neglected. Okay? Not wanted. That's what I felt as a child. Um, and taking the mickey out of, you look like your granny, your old granny you do, when I was 12, and it didn't give me any confidence in the slightest. Um, I don't want to harp on about it, it's Christmas, and um, my mum just doesn't, in quotes, like me. Okay, um, now my dad's gone, I'm finding that she's treating me like my dad. Um, she, used to, she used to take the mickey out of my father and mock him, and now she's doing it to me. Now last night, right, She's been telling me she's been going to bed around 3, 4, 5 o'clock in the evening in pain. And I don't want my mother to be like that. Whatever she thinks about me, I don't want my mother to feel that I don't care. Right? Um, so I'm my mother's daughter. So she used to try and make my dad jealous by going out to male neighbours and male workers and like in quotes have a conversation with them while my dad was sat in the chair. Now I'm her daughter and I know she's cold but I don't need her to keep going to touch me, feel my hands, feel me Janessa I'm cold and I've got to pull my mum up when I'm around there I have to keep pulling her up with my hands and she is extremely heavy and um, my mum said Sue is going to drive my mum to the doctors. Not only does she need medical help for the arthritic pain, um, she needs, you know, disabled equipment to help her get up. But she shouts at me whenever I try to help her. She just doesn't like me. Well, I can't make someone, I can't force, people can't see it unless they come inside the flat and observe my mum's behaviour for a day or a few hours and see how spiteful she is towards me. I can't do anything, right? And to the neighbours it looks like I'm an uncaring daughter but she snipes at me. I'll do that. Get off. And she used to do that when I was a little girl and she's still doing it now. And it hurts me because I want to help her and she won't accept the help. And I'm not any use. I've been told that. I've got no car. Sue's got a car. Um, my 
sister's daughter's boyfriend has got a car. I'm not any use. I've only got my legs. She keeps saying that Derek wanted someone with a car. And the neighbours have got a car, you see. She doesn't want me. I can't help. I can't help. So I called her like, I called the phone last night to check my mother was okay, right? Because my dad, I didn't see him for two months and he passed away. I was worried about my mum, genuinely worried about my mother. Rings the phone up Christmas Day to see if she's okay. I don't want anyone at my funeral. I don't want any alcohol. I don't want any cigarettes and I don't want any drugs. And I don't want to wake either. And I, feel, I, I haven't been able to breathe and I feel like I'm suffocating. And that's what I got before I went to bed last night. With all this racket going on upstairs. And these kids really thumping the ceiling to nearly two in the morning last night. I don't want anyone at my wake. That's what she said to me. Happy Christmas! Woken up this morning in a wonderful mood um, because they were one, his kids were wandering around the ceiling to nearly three in the morning. They didn't get up till half past eight. Fucking fantastic! I had a lion! One more thing. My wonderful family, you know, that does like me, got me a lovely pair of pyjamas as well. And these lovely, lovely, comfortable slippers from Matalan. So I'm dancing in my slippers today. Happy Boxing Day, everybody. And that's the song, isn't it? Suffocating. I'm finding it hard to breathe. There's no air. See you later.